All right, y'all. Now, we know something happened to Young Thug Watch. And it wasn't really just a watch. It was a rich Millie watch. And, you know, I don't even know what kind of watch that is. <laughs> but this, this detective right here knows somebody took that watch out that house. Somebody took that watch out their house, out that man's house. Now look, let's let's hear what he described what he took out the house, y'all. And let's determine what did he did or none of that. And everything we say is allegedly anyway. Until we find uh, out. Sure. Uh, handgun. Uh, another uh, another uh, item was a pink beanie cap. Um, also a black backpack that was recovered as well. Now I wanted to ask you about that. That's it. And that's how he found he land. Listen to this, y'all. Uh-oh. Um, could you be more specific? Okay. Jeffrey Williams was present, correct? <laughs> yes, sir. Martinez Arnold was present. Yes, sir. Diamante Kendrick was present. Yes, sir. Uh, Jeffrey Williams' teenage son was present, correct? I believe so, yes. Okay. My client, Shannon Stilwell, was not present at 355 Allison Drive on May 9, 2022, was he? He was not. Okay. And you don't have any evidence at all that um, Mr. Stillwell has ever even been to that residence, do you? I, no, I don't. Okay. All right, and during that search warrant, um, that search warrant was sought out by investigator, investigator Viverito. Is that correct? I don't believe none they so, see. Yeah. Okay. And during that search warrant, executing that search warrant on May 9th, 2022, uh, you all collected drugs, correct? Suspected drugs? We did. Delta 8 Zero as well? Yes. Okay. Jewelry? Yes. Money? Yes. Phones? Yes. Oh, Jerry. Mr. Williams' cars were seized? That's correct. Um, and I'm not going to ask any questions about any of those things, but you also collected guns, correct? Yes, sir. Okay. In fact, there were six guns collected, correct? I believe so, yes. Okay. Um, and you have reviewed pictures taken during the execution of that search warrant, correct? I did. Okay. Um, I would like to just talk about each gun individually. I can go in what or whatever order you have. If you could just tell us, do you have photos in front of you that display the different types of Thanks guns? Thanks, so yeah. And, and the different guns that were collected on May 9, 2020. The January 10, 2015 shooting of Donovan Thomas. I do not. Okay. All right. I appreciate that, Detective Belknap. I'm going to move to uh, your work on March 17th. Um, when you arrived on Meadowlark Drive, uh, you saw the white Audi, correct? Yes, sir. Still in the parking lot. It was in the driveway, yes. Uh, excuse me. Yes, I'm sorry. The driveway. Um, still had the Maryland tags affixed to it. It did. Still had the tin. I don't recall noting the tent. Okay. I, I don't believe the car had been altered. Okay. You don't believe the car um, had been altered? What do you mean by that? I don't believe the car had been moved or processed. 
So I want to know where they watch. Collected the bean. Well, I agree with that. Just to be clear, it was collected prior to my arrival. And but where they watch it? Look, y'all, he recovered the bean, the guns, the the jewelry, but it ain't then ten, talk about that watch, though. Let's talk about that Richard Millie watch. That backpack? I did not. Okay, have you seen the video uh, from the Phoenix helicopter? I have. Okay, and you would, you would agree that it was Mr. Nichols that threw that book bag into those bushes? Correct? I would. Oh boy. That was collected in that home. Um, I, I believe one was. Do I remember seeing it? I, I certainly don't just you know, a couple years later. Okay. If if a Richard Mille RM zero fifty five Bubba Watson white ceramic watch is now present in property today, do you know what happened to that watch? I wouldn't have any idea. Okay, thank you very much. Yes, sir. They took that watch. I don't want to hear what he got to say. But look, y'all, they they pit they got the uh collect the guns and he said he collected a watch. But he didn't say he collected two watch and then he trying like he can remember what the guns look like, but he can't remember the watch, what the watch looked like, y'all. Come on now. Where is that watch? Y'all took that boy watch. Golly. And you know what, y'all? The way this the way the court been running, I don't believe none of the detective. I believe the detective know where the gun where that watch is. It's so many people hand in this case. So many people hand in this Rico. Uh, I, I don't recall exactly what his question was, but 
But you can recall them guns. Did you actually see Mr. Kendrick in the house? I did not. Okay. Um, the six guns that were found in that house, in, in Mr. Williams' house, um, do you have any evidence that Mr. Kendrick was ever in possession of those six guns? I do not. Do you have any evidence that he was anywhere near those six guns? I do not. Did you take part in the uh, inventory, possession, or transport of the jewelry that was found in Mr. Williams' home? I was, my role during the search was to take photographs of evidence as it was recovered. Do you recall there being two Richard Millay watches in Mr. Williams' home? Uh, I don't know if I would know those if I saw them. Uh, I, so I don't know if there were two or not. Okay. Do you recall seeing a, it's a Richard Millay brand. I understand you don't know what that brand would look like. But do you recall seeing a white ceramic watch with a pink band in the jewelry that you collected or that was collected in that home? Um, I, I believe one was. Do I remember seeing it? I, I certainly don't. This what? A couple years later. Okay. If, if a Richard Millay RM055 bubble watch and white ceramic watch is now present in property today. Do you know what happened to that watch? I wouldn't have any idea. Okay, thank you very much. Yes, sir. Wow, they done stole the darn watch. So the gang unit woman had that watch, y'all, the whole time. The whole time. Let's see what she got to say about that 500K watch. Drive Northeast Atlanta. Verita. And we are back and we are back, y'all. Okay, y'all. Still image from the K-15. That is me. Okay. Do you recall when this was taken? That was on March 9th of 2020. I mean, I'm sorry, May 9th of 2022. And where was it taken? At 355 Allison Drive Northeast Atlanta, Georgia, 30342. And who was that at the time? The home of Jeffrey Williams. And where in the home are you? Should be the master bedroom closet leading to the bathroom. And in the in the video that you watched, which I'm not publishing watch. again because it has your image on it. Correct. Um, what are you doing at that point in the video? We're inventorying the um, jewelry and items that are in the home. Okay. And is this image uh, that's taken that's part of your inventory procedure in the home? Is that correct? It's a documentation procedure. Yes. Okay. And do you recognize what you're holding in your hand in this still image? I do. And, and what are you holding in your hand? A watch of some sort. Okay. Do you know if that's a, do you recognize that as a Richard Mill watch? I, I guess, yes. And that's a pink watch, correct? It's pink and, either pink and light pink. A woman pink color. Yes. With a, it's a pink band, correct? Correct. And it has a white ceramic, I'll call it the body of the watch. It's white, yeah. I guess it's white if you say so, yes. Okay. Where is that watch, V Burita, Burrito, whatever your name is, uh, <laughs> detective? Where is that Richard Milley? Why, why did you go back and, um, I, he said he collected the watch. Now, I had the watch get in your hand. See, I don't know what's going on in this case right here. I don't really know what's going on. You cussed me. How could we believe your testimony? And you out there talking about the other attorney. Uh, what a name. Uh, Kayla. And then you call her out of her name and then the watch missing. So where is the watch? After you, you took this image uh -huh. and you, you did this inventorying process, um, where did the watch go after this? If you watch the video in its entirety, we're, we're in between everything in the closet. There's a bunch of small boxes everywhere. So if you watch the video in its entirety, you take it, and the watch is photographed like this. The box is closed. It's taken and put up on the shelf in the upper left-hand corner, and the inventorying continues. Um, and then jewelry starts getting packed up. And, and that watch is missing. Seven, Or whatever you want to. Um, maybe. Well, uh, that 
streamed. You just are not supposed to be watching it. Oh. And oh. You, you asked that in the evidence. So well, keep you, I wasn't watching the trial, but my name... Don't worry about it. Okay. Just keep moving. Okay. Unless you need to approach about something else. No, that's fine. Okay. Okay. So, Take that for a judge. So, after this watch was inventoried and you left it for, I'm sorry, who did you say takes the watch after the inventory process? Okay. So, if you watch the video in its entirety. Which I can't show here, but right. go ahead. Um, but if you watched it, like I watched it, the, video, the watch gets boxed back up and placed up on the shelf. Look at Miss Hilton. So you trying to say that he did or got the watch? Can we go back to my question? Sure. Sure. Is it the normal procedure to leave high value Look at me here too. behind when you're doing um, a search and then a seizure pursuant to a warrant? Miss Miss Hilton shook her head. Now we talking about that watch. I had asked to be taken, such as photographs and um, artwork that had relevance to Look the that were left behind by the evidence team. It was quite a big operation. Um, there was a hostile crowd gathering at the bottom of the driveway, so we were trying to speed it so up. So you together. trying to say they stole the watch? So are you telling me that law enforcement has no procedure with what you do with high value items that you that are subject to a seizure? No, we're talking about that watch. Jesus at the Last Supper with all the people around him that I thought should, were relevant that were not taken. And like I said, it started to get pretty hostile out there, so we were trying to speed things up. Um, you said that there were many people with body cams in the right. home at the time. How many people um, approximately at the time of this... Um, Rick and Hilton. Look at Will Hilton. I believe they caught Mr. Kendrick running from the home. Uh, yeah, that's not the question I asked. They caught him outside of the home? I don't know how to better come into what, the question. It's either a yes, no. No. Was, is there body cam image of Mr. Kendrick within Mr. Williams' home? The body camera image I saw was him running from the home. Is there body cam Im image of no, Mr. Williams? No, answer yes or no, and then you can explain. In the home? I haven't reviewed it all of the entry team's body camera, but no. Why do you just say no? Did you see Mr. Uh, Mr. Kendrick in Mr. Williams' home? Look at me, okay. Miss Hilton. By the time I arrived at the location, the entry, the entry was already made. Did so I did you, not know. You did not? Okay. No. Did you... There were approximately a half a dozen uh, firearms found within the home, correct? Correct. Um, have you seen any images of Mr. Kendrick possessing any of those firearms? I have not. Have you seen any images of Mr. Kendrick near those firearms? I have not. There were drugs found in the home, correct? Correct. Have you seen, did you see Mr. Kendrick with any of those drugs? No. Did you see Mr. Kendrick? 
drink anywhere near any of those drugs. No. As far as you know, was Mr. Kendrick in possession, in actual possession of any of those drugs? No, I wasn't there when they made entry. Have you spoken to anyone? No, let me take that back. Um, she is something else, y'all. And why they won't show her face? We know what, who she looked like, what she looked like. Beg your girl, y'all. Who knows exactly where young thug missing Richard Millie? Watch. Yes. Y'all see that? The whole time. Mm, 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 mm. Tampering with evidence. Got the watch. Now, young thug, you need to let them pay for that watch. They can't none of them before that watch. Ooh, we. They knew it wasn't just, I never heard of a Richard Miller uh, watch. But that's a beautiful watch. And you making more money than they making. So where is the watch? 